What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna to show you how commercial beekeepers harvest honey. Now I shot this video a year ago, so a little old, but it's still great content. I wanted to share it with you guys. Hope you enjoy. Welcome to More Honey Farm. Today we're going to check out our extraction process, how we get the honey from the bees to the bottle. And the reason we're doing this is because we pride ourselves in the fact that we make real Texas honey, that it's actually local honey from bees. So we're showing you exactly how we get the honey from the bees to the bottle here at our shop at More Honey Farm. Let's check it out. So in the field, we pull the honey off of the bees. You'll see some of that happening right here. Now this is a yard uh, in Beaumont that we were pulling honey off of. So from the field, these are the frames that are inside the honey boxes. And this is how the bees store honey. So you have capped honey here and you have uncapped honey here. These are cells that they were filling with honey. And what they do is they fill them up and then they dry them to get the moisture level down, which turns the nectar into honey and then they cap them like this. And you can see as I run my thumb over the capped honey, you can see the honey coming out. So this is what the frames look like coming from the field. We take them, we store them in this warehouse, and from there, we're gonna move them out and load them onto the conveyor that's gonna go to the extraction line, and we'll show you that now. So this is what a full frame of honey looks like. Ideally, everything looks this way. So just like that, here's another frame. It's a good capped frame full of honey. So what's happening here is we're taking the boxes of honey off of the pallets. It's going onto a conveyor. We're cleaning the, we're cleaning the bottom bar and we're cleaning the top bar from extra wax so that they'll feed through the machine. And they're getting loaded onto the conveyor. So when the boxes come in from outside, they're going into this uncapper, which has a deep boxer, which is removing the frames from the box shell. And then the frames are pushed into the uncapper where the cappings and honey fall down into the vat and the frames that are uncapped go up the conveyor. Once the frames are uncapped, they're dripping with honey. They're headed up the conveyor. This extraction cycle is done. We opened it back up, and now he's using this cylinder, this pneumatic cylinder, that's gonna grab the full frames, push the full frames onto the extractor while unloading the empty frames. So once this is full, we're gonna start to rotate the extractor, and then you fire up the extractor with the motor, and it's gonna spin and sling the honey out. So when the honey is thrown out, it drains down to the bottom of the extractor, and then runs along this pipe right here, and goes to the vat that's underneath the uncapper. And then everything that's draining on the conveyor, the honey is running down the conveyor into that same vat. As he loads and unloads the extractor, we've got these empty frames headed down this conveyor where these guys are taking the empty frames and the empty boxes and they're putting the empty frames back inside the boxes and stacking them back up on pallets. So from the honey vat, there's a pump that pumps the honey up and over 
into what's called a spinner, honey wax separator. Now what the spinner is doing is throwing the honey to the outside while the beeswax falls down through the middle of it. So let's check that out. The honey is pumping out and over and into the spinner. The honey and the wax together from the vat, you know, it's all the wax uncappings and the wax that's come from the frame mixed with the honey. The honey is going down the middle and the beeswax, the beeswax falls out the middle. So that's dry beeswax. And the clean honey, you come around here, Clean honey is getting thrown out and into this vat where it's then pumped into a storage tank. So the clean honey is pumped to this 10,000 gallon storage tank. And you can see the level, it's about halfway up right now. We got about 5,000 gallons of honey in this tank right now. It's a ton of honey. We will pump it out and into some 55 gallon barrels where it'll be stored in our warehouse. So in our warehouse, the barrels that we keep in there actually stay between 55 to 60 degrees. So they crystallize, they solidify, uh, which is a natural process that honey does over time. Um, it's a natural process that actually preserves the flavor and the color of the honey. So what we do when we're ready to go into the bottle, move those barrels in here. This is a clean hot room and we've got uh, agitators that are gonna stir the honey, break up the crystals to make it liquid again and from there, that liquid honey that comes out of this room will go into these tanks right here where the honey is stored and goes directly into the bottling pump. Thanks for watching guys. If you want to see more, subscribe, like the video, comment down below what you think, and uh, well, well, we'll have some honey, honey flow updates coming for you soon. We're not harvesting this year just quite yet. Wanted to share this video with you ahead of time. We're going to have some more content coming soon. See you later.